legacy of American cuisine reaches far beyond the Middle East. In her new book, The Arab's Table, the writer and cookbook author Reed Cassis pulls together the vast diaspora of Arab cuisine, using recipes to build the foundation of cooking and culture of the Arab world. Good breakfast. That's a nice place. Well, yeah, I got food in me and cars mostly charged. Actually could use the topping off, but down to 87%. lower by the time I get where I'm going. Look at this nasty weather. Yuck. 45 degrees. Nasty. everybody Sunday oh where's the sunglasses trying to put a lot of hours in today yet. Everybody's in a hurry. Got 
gotta drive faster. Bad weather, right? This stuff is almost uh, slushy coming down. It's kind of uh, got a sleet feel to it. temperature temperature drop now down to 44 degrees and we're back to no rain and sunshine <laughs> Cleveland Gotta love it. People driving on your ass on the highway at 70, you know. I don't get that whole thing. Can't see the comments, too bright. Ooh. Piggly Wiggly. traffic out today. Assholes out here today tailgating like mad. Everybody's in a hurry. Wow. Oh, the joys of driving. Now this pickup truck decides to get over. Everybody's in. Hurry, hurry, get your page on. Speed, speed, speed. I feel the need for speed.
Eleven stitches. Baba. Food was very good. Service was excellent. Just drove through that crazy weather. Now it's bright sunshine. Alright, I'm gonna go up here to Lakewood. No, Tesla is a rear wheel. If it's a single motor, it's rear wheel. If it's all wheel drive, well, then it's a all wheel drive. So it's a dual motor. But if it's a single motor, it's rear wheel. Oh my gosh, Laura. I say most accidents happen in the home. <laughs> Especially if you have a crazy uh, uh, roommate. <laughs> uh, I, I like front wheel drive after years of driving them. You know, uh, but this car, I would prefer to have this as a. I should have turned left. Um, as an all-wheel because of the way the, the the traction control and the way the car meters the power in in the snow this car would be better as an all-wheel in the snow than just rear I, I had a couple days of experience with snow in the rear and I didn't really like what it how it functions based versus a uh, a standard internal combustion engine car where I can just uh, spin the tires as much as I want or need in, in funky weather situations. Uh, I'm not so sure I like how this thing uh, uh, worked. I only had a couple days of it, a few hours. Oh, Hollywood, Hollywood. 
وقت كنت احل لي making every one of these lights that's crazy you never make all those lights Where's your turn signal? Ooh, that's a nice looking little dresser there. Okay, she's a good citizen. She picked up the doggy. The doggy do. Where are we going here? I guess I'll go left. Hey, CJ. Yeah, I've got to get back on the road here in a very short moment. I really need to try to get a shitload of trips in. I don't know if I'll do it or not. We'll see. If I can stay driving, I can maybe do it, but I've got to keep driving. Do I, will I have the energy to do it? The fortitude. The wherewithal. Here's looking at you. Oh, that's a pretty wall there. That's a nice mural there. It's a very pretty mural. I found another little secret mural over here the other day. Can I turn left there? No, here, I'll go this way. I'll just show you this one a little bit. Maybe I'll show you the one I just passed. Also. Strawberry lemonade. Yeah, they're all new. The only guy that's the got any name recognition and who's been around is Donovan Mitchell. He's the old dude on the team now. Everybody else is new. And a friend of mine painted this uh, little uh, sort of alley space, this walkway actually between buildings over here. I stumbled on it the other day after having coffee and a sandwich. This is very cool. Uh, that's the artist, Eileen Dorsey. Very cool. Little things, you know, make uh, the world go round. <laughs> no turn on red. No, no left turn, no right turn, no forward turn, no turn on red, right turn to Madison only. Make up your mind. <laughs> Oh yeah, Jeff, yep. I think I ate there once before. I tried to go there the other day, it was closed. 
Yeah, it's a good place. I, uh, very nice vibe. Good food. I will definitely hit it again. Uh, strawberry lemonade. Never had one. I'll show you this other mural. It's pretty cool. <sighs> Green light. The beep lets you know. Right turn only. It's a cool little coffee shop here. The Blue Cafe. I'm going to go over here and show you this cool mural on the side of the building. Oh, there's another one over there, too. I might know who painted this one, actually. Also, no, I don't know who that is. That's a pretty cool one. There's another one over here. Where is it? Yep, right over here. Back there. That's pretty cool. I like that one. Boom! It's like full of energy. I at the other day that I learned about that? Oh, that was uh, Detroit, right? All the, the cool alleyways in Detroit that they've uh, worked on uh, um, decorating and embellishing with art and lighting and stuff. So, that's that would be some more fun stuff to go do in Detroit to knock around some of those alleys at night or in the evening when they change to night. This is a nice street in Lakewood here. Huge lawns, nice setbacks on the houses. Lakewood's a very desirable place to live. These houses would all be probably in the 300,000 range, like over 200 easy, probably 300 in this street, maybe more. It's the Lakewood Library, it's a huge library. It's the whole city block across Detroit here. There's your Taco Bell. <laughs> the Mary Arts Pub and Grill, a famous Lakewood watering hole. Oh, there's a... Remember, not flat. 
We checked. Well, if you're ever looking for a fun place to drink and grab a bite in the summer on a summer night or a nice nice afternoon, the Lakewood <coughs> Truck Park over here on the right is a cool fun stop, dog friendly. It's uh there's a couple of these around the area. Got an outdoor seating and got uh, food trucks they can have at least three food trucks parked in there they got an indoor bar space also <coughs> lots of bars right around here probably 10 of them Cleveland vegan really good vegan restaurant a friend of mine owns All right, got to hang up, go do my next uh, mission here. See you guys later. There's the Beck Center for Arts, local arts institution here in Lakewood. Theater mostly. <laughs> All right. Ciao, everybody. Have a good Sunday afternoon.